Hello, I'm David Tipling and welcome to my garden. This is a short video on photographing garden birds. We have a friendly robin in our garden at the moment and I'm going to show you how I lured him onto a setup using mealworms and took my pictures using the Olympus Share app and a short lens. By using the remote control feature in the Olympus Share app, you don't have to be sat in a hide in the garden. You can be in your kitchen or living room and you don't need to use a long lens. The app allows you to autofocus, change ISO, shutter speed and aperture. So it gives you complete control. Here I've used the 12 to 40 millimeter lens on camera on a tabletop tripod focused on this setup scene. The mealworms were placed close to the camera so the bird was a little wary to start with and went straight on the fork handle and gave me my shot. Here's another setup using a garden cane to which I fixed a sprig of blossom and placed it close to but out of shot of the food. With patience your subject should hopefully use your perch resulting in a natural looking image as here with this blue tip on blackthorn blossom. Water is a great way to attract birds in summer. Here a young great spotted woodpecker has come down to drink at one of my pools. But I'm going to show you now how to use an old dustbin lid as a bird bath. And you can make it look natural too. Dress it with moss or a little bit of bark or something just to give it a natural feel. I've put stones in the bottom to raise the height a little so species like blackbirds will wade into the middle and have a good bathe. OK, so there's a few ideas for photographing birds in your garden. I'm David Tipling and thanks for watching.